In this tutorial, we will be learning about equivalent rational expressions. When two rational expressions are equivalent, they look different but have the same value. Here is a general form example, and here is a more specific example. Now, let's take a closer look. Think back to when you were working with fractions. One of the first things your teacher may have used to teach you about fractions was a pizza. If you have half of a pizza and it is one giant piece, your fraction is 1 over 2. If you have half of a pizza and that half is cut into 4 pieces, your fraction representing that pizza is 4 over 8. These fractions are equivalent. While they look different, they represent the same amount. This is the same idea that we are going to apply to rational expressions. Consider the following rational expression. 7x plus 2 over x minus 9. When we multiply this by 1, it is still the same rational expression. Now, let's multiply by x squared plus 1 over x squared plus 1. When we expand this out, we get a very different looking rational expression. But, it is equivalent as we multiplied it by 1. Let's take a look at this graphically to see what is happening here. Our original rational expression can be seen here. Now consider the graph of our new equivalent rational expression. It is the same, which is what we expected because multiplying by x squared plus 1 over x squared plus 1 is the same as multiplying by 1, which does not change the value of the rational expression. In this lesson, you learned about equivalent rational expressions. These are rational expressions that look different but have the same value.